Feel Good Breakfast Show. It's Expresso right here on SABC3. Time to get into some tech news, huh? Absolutely, absolutely. Now, many have warned against the potential threats of AI, and others are singing its praises for how it can improve the world and lives of people around us. Now, DeepMind, an AI company owned by Google's parent company Alphabet, wants very much to be part of the latter. The company is partnering with conservationists and ecologists on a project that uses artificial intelligence algorithms to detect and count animals in millions of photos taken over the past nine years in Tanzania's Serengeti National Park and taking into consideration how difficult it can be to capture photos of moving animals without motion blur the AI will be able to detect these animals even when they appear as relatively a blurry image now most conservationists are of the opinion that this could greatly improve their efforts to monitor and track populations populations of animals and this makes the conservation effort a lot easier especially in areas like the Serengeti where growing human activity poses a threat to the ecosystem. Huh? This is great news. I'm, a, I'm in favor of that Where one. AI is finally being used for a good cause here, and not trying here. to crack down our smart devices and invade our privacy. Rather save the environment using it. Eh? Exactly. Just take over the human race in general. <laughs> <laughs> so do let us know which other stories have captured your imagination from the world of technology you share them with us on our social media platforms of course hashtag expresso show but right now calling on all gamers especially if you're a lover of first person shooter kind of format games a new generation of wolf wolfenstein, wolfenstein young blood brought to you game. of course by gareth woods played all the time <laughs>